Hey, what is going on guys? So you have a iPhone XS or XS Max. I'm gonna show you how to add different kind of wallpaper to your home screen as well as your lock screen, as well as like a live photo, okay? So very, very simple. So first thing you gotta do is simply just go into your settings here. And then from settings, you wanna scroll down, you wanna go down to where it says wallpaper. Tap on wallpaper. And this is the, this is the one that I currently have on right now. And if I click on choose a wallpaper, now we have dynamic, stills, and live, and I'll show you how to add your own personal photo on the home screen as well as the live screen in, uh, in one second. But we have dynamic here, so you can see the uh, preloaded uh, dynamic photos here. Basically, there's like animation, so if I tap on that, it slowly goes out and goes in. And if I set this, I can set it, and I can set it to my lock screen or my home screen or both. If I set it to both, now we can see that it's on my lock screen. You can see it slowly coming in. Also, same thing with the lock screen, okay? You can see it slowly going in and out, okay? And if we go back to settings here, we have the stills. Uh, you can see the default one is down here. Anyways, if I just pick one like this, and we have a still, which is just a photo. Perspective is, if I leave it on perspective, if I kind of move, if you look at the moon here, it kind of like moves a little bit. That's the perspective. And of course you can set it to home screen or lock screen or both. Okay, let me cancel that. And then we'll just go back here and then we have a live, live photo here. So for example, if I press and hold, you're gonna get this like animation. As, and then you can let go. Animation, let go. Another thing you can do with the live photos is you can make it a still as well or you can make it perspective. Okay, now you can't zoom in and out on the uh, preloaded uh, wallpapers here but what you can do is uh, if uh, for example let me just go ahead and take a quick photo here I'll take a photo of this right here and I'll also do a live photo okay a live photo is basically when I as soon as I press on the uh, this is the live photo um, icon right there so as soon as I take the photo it's going to re record two to three seconds prior for me hitting the uh, photo button so for example okay one, two, three. Okay, now if we go to the live photo here. You can see how that looks, okay? So if I go to my settings here, and then I can go to uh, live photos, and then here's the live photo right here, and then I can go ahead and zoom in and out from here as well, okay? If I press and hold, you can kind of see that. Of course, you can make it a still picture, or you can do a perspective, and still you'll be able to um, zoom in and out. And if, for example, if I zoom in like this and I stay there and I set it to both, it's gonna be exactly like that on both. On my home screen, but you don't get the live animation here on the home screen. However, on the lock screen here, you will have it on here. Oh, I didn't leave it on the uh, live photo option. Let me go back to the uh, settings here. And this is the live photo here. And I'll leave it on live photo here, okay? I'll go ahead and zoom in right there. And now you can see how that is. So I'll go ahead and set this one to both. And again, it's not gonna be on the uh, home screen, but if I go to the lock screen, now we should get like a animation here, as you can see, okay? And of course, you can always go and put one of your regular photos on here, like that photo I just took. Uh, let's see here, that last photo I took was right here. Actually, I'll just go with this photo here. And then, which is with just a regular photo that's not live photo, you is either still or perspective, okay? Perspective, you can kind of see the, the phone on here like moving like slightly. And you can set one or the other again. I'll set this one to both. And so I have the same picture on here as well as my lock screen. So pretty simple. Hope that helped you guys out. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one.